weary traveler. You have been traversing through the desert for 40 days and 40 nights, but not in a religious way. And you find yourself very tired and thirsty indeed. Please, here, take a sip from this blue enchanted Nalgene cup. <laughs> oh, no! You've awakened this sh genie! This sh genie is now unleashed, and he has ten props for you! He has ten wishes which could be granted to fulfill your wildest desires. However, each one comes with a catch. Will you take the genie's offer, or will you choose to not do it and then die? Because of the nature of the game, sometimes the drawbacks are subjective. Okay? Sometimes what is an L to me is not an L for you. Because of this, we have to come to an agreement. I have to be the arbiter of what is and isn't a loss. We can't do this unless you shake my hand right now and agree that yes, that's how this has to function. Thank you for reaching through the screen. Go ahead and like the video while you're at it, okay? You've shaken my hand. The genie is now ready to go. Now, the first one is always a bit of a test, okay? We're gonna go ahead and see how this goes. You can redesign yourself whenever you want. Like in The Sim, you can change anything, anytime, always. And not just your clothes, but like your body too. And you know what? Actually, even skills, even skills here. Wait, can you do skills in the character creation or no? Are you allowed to do that? That changes things. Yes? No, you can't, but you can change personality traits. Okay, so if you like, if you're like bipolar, you could just take that shit off. Be like, I don't want that actually. Or if you're just very dumb, you'd be, uh oh, I'm very smart now actually. You could just make yourself cheerful. Okay, so if you're, if you got a bad mood or something, okay. I don't know how the Sims character creation works. Neither does the genie, surprisingly. I'm not the genie, but I, I'm close with the genie, and I can tell you, he doesn't really understand exactly how the Sims character creation thing works, but he's rolling with it. Just think you can be anybody you want to be at any moment, at any time. However, keep in mind there is a drawback. Behind a thick layer of the genie's fog, anything could be back there. You could be a celebrity look-alike, try to steal their riches. You could design yourself into your, your, your crush's type. You could rob a bank and then change your, your character immediately right after. You could do so many things with this. And it seems as though I have convinced all of you to hit the button here. <laughs> oh, that's why the genie keeps me around. For you see, 66% of you have agreed to hit the button, which is fantastic. That's amazing. That's really good. Because the drawback is you can't change your hands, which becomes super hairy, and you can't see your skin through all of the hair. There's a lot of hair on your hands. Honestly, I think you guys win. I think you guys win. It's a W, I think. You have gloves. Yeah, you have very thick gloves. I think if you use some pomade, you could just turn them into, like, leather gloves, and that would just be a really weird, like, personality trait. But that'd be fine. What the fuck is this prompt? Even, Shitty Genie has quickly just become like a, what the fuck were they doing on this site in 2011? Some of these prompts are fucked up. They get way worse. Shave, it is too thick to shave. You will break every razor you ever try. I'm gonna give you the W on this because I think the power, I wasn't going to, but being able to change your personality at a moment's notice immediately, and there's not even like a limit, like once a day, I think it's a W. And you could also change your skills. You, this, I think it's a W, barely, barely, okay? You could cover up your hands too. Well, I don't, I don't know. I think they're so hairy, you can't, like you can't put on gloves on top of it. You don't have to put on like boxing gloves. <laughs> and you're just walking around with boxing gloves everywhere. Be the weird boxing glove guy. G says, all right, you know what? Fine, he rubs his temples. Thinks, thinks briefly, takes in a deep breath. Okay. You can talk with all animals. Genie says, yes. He has a good one here. You guys really don't want to talk with animals? You don't think that's cool? Are you serious? I can't believe all of you are saying no. Where's your whimsy? Do you have no imagination? It would be so cool. I guess it'd make you sad when you eat meat, though. He's baiting us? I'm not. I'm shocked that everybody said no right away. Can you turn it off? Yes. Well, no. You can't turn it off. You just don't have to talk to them. It's like people. You can just ignore them. I don't want to hear the insects crawling in my walls while I'm sleeping. Insects are not animals. I hereby decree. Dude, that would be awful. Imagine putting your ear to an ant hill. Serve the queen. Serve the queen. Serve the queen. Queen. Food. Food. Queen. Queen. Food. All right. Everybody's saying no on this one, which I'm shocked by. You don't want to converse with all of God's creatures? Okay. Sure. 
Well, your mind might change when you see this drawback as he lifts the fog to reveal that perhaps you could have talked with all animals, but you could not have talked with humans! Oh no! <laughs> oh, you would have lost the ability to talk with people. <laughs> you, you win again. There's no way to spin this. It's a big W. You win, obviously. I'll admit this is an L. I, well, you know, I, I I tried to think of a way to spin it. There's no way to spin it the other way. In what world would you want to be able to talk to animals but not people? Like, you could be, like, an animal whisperer, but, like, you wouldn't be able to tell what they're saying. You wouldn't be able to defend yourself, right? Tarzan moment? Yeah, I don't think there's a way to... There's not a way to spin this. You guys won. It's a W. Fine. You didn't take the deal. You guys are traversing this pretty well, by the way. Because you guys usually get blown up immediately, so... Perhaps you've grown wise to the genie's tricks. Perhaps he's not as shitty or evil as he used to be. You have an infinitely amount of money. You have an infinite amount of money. As much money as you could ever wish for. Billions and billions of dollars. Money can't buy happiness. I will never. Are you sure? I don't think you have enough imagination of how much money you could make. What about one million dollars? Does that change your tune, chatter? Everybody wants to hit the button. Look at that. Everybody wants infinite riches. But you suck and smell. No! <laughs> no, don't worry. You will not suck or smell. There will be no sucking or smelling happening behind the genie's fog. But perhaps there is something even worse. Who knows? We die in five years, don't we? No, that is not it. There's no death involved. I will tell you that. Foolish chatters, the genie tells lies. Perhaps he does, but not about these infinite riches, for you see, he drops upon you a wallet with a, a endless cash. All sorts of different currencies come out of the wallet. However, right as you're walking away, the genie grabs your so shoulder. He says, wait, aren't you forgetting something? For with the infinite amount of money, secret wallet comes a stipulation. You can no longer sexually pleasure yourself ever again. No more masturbation ever. It's a W. That's what the money is for. You could go to Vegas and it's legal there. You're fine. Sex work is easier to find than ever before. Congratulations. You won. Okay. Wow, that genie sucks ass. Yeah, this one wasn't very good. I didn't think you guys would go for the, for the, for the infinite riches. I thought that would be too, too enticing and you guys would see do the trick. But I don't want to have sex. I want to masturbate. Well, then it's an L for you. I'm just saying, that's what the money is for. If you have infinite riches, but you can't do anything yourself, you'll figure it out. You'll figure something out. Craigslist is right there. That's probably not a good place. <laughs> there's probably a high-end one. If you have infinite money, there's probably a high-end one you can find. Craigslist? Hey, I'm old. That's how it was back in the day. Back in the day, it was it was, it was was a Craigslist angle because there was nothing else. Do not have Craigslist sex. You will definitely get jumped in an alley and mugged. What were you doing on Craigslist? Me? Finding cars? Collecting retro video games? I just thought that was where people found, like, one-night encounters or whatever. Genie getting his ass beat today. Yeah, the genie leans back. Jeez, this has never... This has never happened. This is actually unprecedented. Usually, you guys are way worse at this. Okay, whatever. The genie said, ah, fuck you. Whatever. It's That one, I, I really thought that the concept of infinite money would throw you guys off. The genie thinks again and he conjures up something so diabolical that you have no chance but to fall for his, his japes. Your Twitch subscriptions are free. Free Twitch subs for anyone who wishes. Yes, who goes for this prompt. You can have a free sub to any channel. Dude, why is everybody saying no? Are you serious? Why is it? Guys, it's free subs to everybody. Isn't that so cool? You don't get any ads. You get no ads ever. We already have infinite money. No, no, no. There's a different world. You don't have infinite money anymore. No, d d d okay. The prompts are not the same between thing to thing. I guess it is foolish to put this right after the infinite money. The genie was very unwise, I think, with this one. Think of all the, the people you could just donate. Thousands and thousands of dollars to small streamers playing your favorite game. I know how much you guys love the thousand year door. You never shut the hell up about it. Wouldn't you like to make them rich? All the speedrunners or whatever? All right, you don't take the genie's deal. No free subs for anybody. And that may have been a shame. For you see, although you won't receive infinite free Twitch sub subscriptions, if you did push the button, your favorite streamer would disappear and never be heard of again. No! But I'm okay. 
actually an L? What, you guys want it? Am I, would that have killed me? Is that what you would have done? I would have died? And you wanted me to die so it's an L? I guess, I, I guess it's a W. Hbox would vanish and Smash would die. Oh my god. Don't say that in here. You're gonna get descended on by a pack of wolves. Hbox W right now. Let's check some heads in the chat right now. I don't even know if I, hold on. I actually, I'm curious. I actually don't know. No way. I'll time myself out. No! This has never happened before. You guys are usually so bad at this game. The genie is 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 frazzled now. He's really mad, like in a video game. He's like steaming and turning orange and shit, flashing colors. The genie is mad now. Will that make him better or worse? Let's find out. He comes up with a brand new prompt. Fuck you. You can eat whatever you want and you never get fat. You could go feast mode on every single food on the planet. Try delicacies from all over the world. You guys are so confident. Why is it always 70 to 30? It's gonna taste like feet. There's nothing wrong with the food. There is nothing wrong with the food. The food is 100% fine and okay. You're not gonna get sick. You don't gain weight, everything's okay. It's fine. There is taste. It tastes good. It doesn't make you sick. You can get as much as you want. This game got way easier when you made this fog seep through. Shut up! It's not see through. You guys don't wanna eat anything you want without ever getting fat? I could just go to the gym. No, you can eat anything at all, ever, of any amount, any portion, from anywhere in the world. These are young chatters. Yeah, they don't get it. They don't get it. Fog lifts, and the genie was really weird with this one. I don't know why the fuck the genie came up with that. That kind of killing the vibe here, genie. What? The He's really mad. This genie is angry. Chat avoided a bullet on this one, I think. I don't. He's pissed. I don't know why. He's the genie's really angry now. That's not even funny, Genie. What's your problem? Jesus Christ, dude. Dial it back. You guys won. It may have been for the wrong reasons, but uh, the Genie reflects on his behavior and says, huh, I really got to talk to somebody about this. It's a fucked up Genie, man. <laughs> We're living rent-free in the Genie's head. The Genie has never gone 0 for 7. He's not used to this. You inherit one billion dollars. You don't get the infinite money from last time. You had a million dollars, but you don't have it anymore. Now you get one billion dollars. What do you wish to do? Do you take the genie's offer of one billion dollars? Chat is folding tonight. Look at all the no's here. Chat is, is playing very close to the chest. However, now it's flipping the other way. Wait a minute. People realize the extra zeros on that. Wait, <laughs> wait, one billion you said? Not a million. But a billion. Yeah, now it's 50-50. Chat's not so sure anymore, are they? The genie sits back with a smug expression. <laughs> I guess that's the magic number. Not infinite money, but one billion. It's a finite amount, but it might as well be infinite, right? What do you wish to do? Oh my god, it's almost tied. By the way, tie is an auto loss. <laughs> tie is you both die because you didn't decide. Tie means you took too long to decide and the genie kills you. The genie just made that up. The genie... The genie needs all the help he could get. The genie says, actually, I made up a new rule. And he's a genie, so he can do that. Do you wish to inherit one billion dollars? Yes, says chat. The genie laughs. Ha 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 ha. Foolish chat. One billion dollars for you. And he gives you a wallet. It's a lot like the other one, but it has one billion in it. And they're all dollars. However, it comes with a catch. You can only buy one thing. I actually don't know. What would you buy with this? I mean, it's it's a W, I guess, but like, what would you buy? I need you to convince me. One billion is so much money to spend at once. A house? You have a billion dollars. You can get, if you bought a house with one billion dollars, you would have like 999 million left. Stocks? That's boring. Literally gold. One gold? You can buy one gold. One big gold. You can't do that. A wheelbarrow of gold? It's a free something, no drawbacks. Yeah, but wouldn't it really hurt if you didn't have anything ready at that exact moment and then you bought something that wasn't worth a billion dollars? That would be an L, right? Wouldn't that be bad? <laughs> Bro wants an L so bad. Fuck, man. How are you guys winning? This is so stupid. Finally winning Coney's Carnival game. I told you they're not rigged. You guys were just bad at them before. Honestly, I'm a good streamer if you guys know how to play the game now. I've taught you all so well, true? I am Master Splinter and you all are my little turtles. Your dog dies! 
<laughs> sad. I felt bad saying that. <laughs> this feels bad after tonight. This isn't funny now. All right, let's say your dog died. So there, there, there's, there's, a, there's an upside, okay? Your dog passed away. It's very sad, but there's an upside behind the fog this time, not a downside. You lost your best friend, uh, but maybe something good could be behind the fog. This is a very bad prompt this late in the game, <laughs> especially being down 0-9. This is the disaster. Guys, something nice could happen. The, the genie would not kill your dog unless there was a very good reason. The genie would not let your dog pass unless he had a very good reason to do so. Although now he's very angry, so he might. He might have put this there out of sheer spite. But he cooked these all up way before. I don't have a dog. Well, okay, you're given a dog for this. You were given a dog and you have no attachment to it, so you should hit yes. Right? Why did you give me a dead dog? The genie is very mysterious. Coney, would you accept the deal? No. Uh, you guys are going to feel really dumb in a second for not letting your dog die. You're going to feel so stupid because your dog would die. But when you had a child, it would be your dog reincarnated. Oh, no. You guys blew it. You guys lost. Wouldn't that be so cool? Having a kid that was your old dog? Oh, man. I think that's an L for you guys. I think you guys lost on this one. Let's not talk about it anymore. That's an L. Oh, you guys had a perfect streak. Who doesn't want this? The genie gave you an easy layup. You can reminisce on all the old times. I'm really trying to, trying to sell this. I don't think I can do this. I can't give you an L here. I'll cheat, but I can't cheat that much. Probably should have put this earlier so you didn't have to spin it. Well, I didn't think you would be 9-0. Guys, I thought by this point, I would be able to argue with you. Like, when I craft the shitty genie, by this point in the show, I'm supposed to be able to convince you that you got an, an L or a W. The problem is that there's no tension. Because clearly, fucking, you guys went fucking 10-0. There's no way to win. That was number 10, actually. Actually, no, because we cut out, we cut out... We cut out the university question. That actually got removed from all of your memories. You don't remember it anymore. That wasn't supposed to be in the video. So actually, that wasn't here, and that wasn't a part of it, so you're actually 9-0. You're 9-0, but I took a question away. Hold on. The genie removes all of your memories from 30 minutes ago. <laughs> no, now you forgot everything. You don't remember anymore. It's actually two L's, and it has been the whole time. The genie assures you, two L's will kill you. Genie's got to cook on these next two. He could still win. Genie could still win. Wha-bam! You have to eat a live snake! There's something that will happen if you do, good or bad. Does it fight back? Maybe. It could, perhaps. Can I cook it? It's live. It's in a live snake. If it says poisonous behind that fog, we will cook your ass. <laughs> I mean, you guys are eating the snake. What do you want me to say? I'm not telling you what the drawback is. Or the benefit. Maybe it's a good thing. Maybe it's a bad thing. Maybe it's poisonous and you die. Maybe not. Why does everyone want to eat the live snake? Why is it all so easy for you to decide to eat the live snake? I'm a little surprised and concerned. Why did everybody say yes? You could do this now. You don't need a genie for this. No way it's worth it. Well, everybody seems to disagree. 66% of chat have chosen to eat the live snake. And so the guy gives you a live snake, the GD. And he says, here, eat this snake. And you're wrestling with the snake and you're wiggling with it. And it bites you. Ouch! The snake is not poisonous, but it does bite you all over. Ooh, this hurts. And then you chomp it and you bite it. Where do you start? The head? Maybe the tummy. Where are you going to start on the snake? It's biting the shit out of you. But maybe it was all worth it. For you see, you were forced to eat a live snake, but the genie drops the fog, and it turns out that snake was genetically modified to taste exactly like chocolate or peanut butter or gummy worms. It was delicious. What a yummy snake. It's a fucking L. You lose because you're covered with snake bites. I will not hear an argument about this. You had a tasty treat. You could have gotten that at the store for $3. You can buy chocolate at the store for less than $5, and you have a billion. You have an infinite amount of money, and you got bitten by snakes. It's a fucking hell. You fucking lost now. I've been losing all night, and you lost this one. You got bit to shit. You lost. Sorry, dude. My feelings got really hurt when you didn't take the dead dog deal. I thought you would be like, there has to be a good payout for this. 
You guys have seen through all my tricks tonight. <laughs> you made up us being bitten. It's a live snake. It's not going to let you eat it. The biting is 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 implied, okay? Snakes can't rapid bite. Okay, I th you're getting bit at least three times. You know what? The snake is poisonous. You died. You ate the live snake, but you died. He's not poisonous. I said he wasn't poisonous for you to eat, but he was poisonous for for bites. Venomous. Yeah, he, I didn't say he was poisonous, but he's venomous. Yes. Sorry, guys. You know, the genie, he got you. The genie is very tricky indeed. I agree with Coney, chat. See? See? That's my favorite chatter right there. This is the most absurd L of my life. Oh, perhaps you'll take another in just a moment. The final wish. The last wish to be revealed. The final prompt. You become a Pokemon trainer. Well, well, well. You get to catch all sorts of Pokemon. Damn, nobody wants to become a Pokemon trainer? Why not? I'm shocked that nobody wants it. We've done like Pokemon stuff before and people want it. 30 FPS? Okay, you live in 60 FPS. Honestly, you might be kind of wise, though. That might be a very dangerous place. All the Pokemon running around, maybe you'll catch something you can't handle. Big-ass monsters, right? You might be right. You might be true. I don't know. Like a gummy snake. Well, actually, that chocolate peanut butter gummy snake might be real in the Pokemon world, right? Well, nobody wanted to take the genie's deal. Nobody wants to be a Pokemon trainer. So nobody wants to catch Pokemon and train them to be their very own. Nobody wants to be the very best. Okay, the genie says. That's fine. You don't need Pokemon. However, if you were to become a Pokemon trainer, the drawback is that only Pokemon that you would be able to train would be Rattata and Bidoof. Chad is celebrating. However, I regret to inform you, there is nothing in the prompt that specifies that you live in the Pokemon world. Which means that in this scenario, you could be the only breeder, trainer, and creator of Rattataz and Bidoof worldwide. You could have ran a Rattata and Bidoof empire and had a monopoly on a very special pet that nobody else could touch. Chat, it's for that reason. Unfortunately, it's an L and the genie wins. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You could have had infinite Rattatas and Bidoofs all over the world. You could have had an empire selling Rattatas and Bidoofs anywhere you wanted to go. Unfortunately, it's an L, and that's going to do it. Hey, Twitch chat died. YouTube, what did you think? You guys all lived. You guys are my favorite. You know that, right? Thanks for watching. Was that fun? Thanks for watching. Like the video. Subscribe. Wasn't that a great time? See you next time. Goodbye, YouTube. So long. Goodbye. Goodbye, everybody. Are you really not going to pay out for a 10-1? I mean, the rules were, were, you know, the rules were very clear. You know what I'm saying? Like, you guys kind of fumbled that last one.